Hey everyone, I have a really small solution to a very big problem and if you clicked on this title you're probably having issues trying to connect your optical drive headphones into your PlayStation 5 because if you're like me you bought your PlayStation 5 just to realize that it doesn't have an optical drive like the PlayStation 4 did. So if you bought $300 optical drive headphones and that you can't really use to its like full capacity you're probably going to be a little annoyed and you're going to look for a solution. I'm going to tell you right now, I've tried everything from extension cables to auxiliary cables into Y splitters. And that was just a mess. Having wires connected to the controller, having wires connected into the headset, just made everything wired again. Nothing was wireless anymore. The experience just went down the drain. And if that wasn't enough, the audio quality just straight went out the window. So let me just save you your time and show you that the Astro HDMI adapter is going to completely solve this problem for you. Absolutely. It's an HDMI adapter where you would plug in the PlayStation HDMI into that adapter. And then from there, you'll have an additional HDMI out, the optical drive port, and the power supply. So if you don't know really what I'm talking about, I'll show you right here. There it is, the Astro HDMI adapter. This is the front side of it, HDMI input. This is the back side, is the HDMI output and the SPDIF, which is also the optical drive, and then the power supply. In use, this is pretty much what it's going to look like. And this is going to be the back. And let me just tell you right now that I've already been using this and I absolutely love it. It's the cleanest, like it might seem like extra stuff, but it's the cleanest way to get the best audio quality while not affecting any of your hardware. Your controller stays wireless, your headset stays wireless. And honestly, the quality is really the best part when you put it on, let's say if you're playing Call of Duty, you put it on boost low, or you could put it on like home theater. Uh, I believe it's uh, what a theater mode, I believe in Call of Duty. So many different games have so many different sound settings, but I'm telling you right now, with the Astro A50s, you're going to get the best sound possible. I can even show you a little bit. This is the headset I have. Uh, I paid 300 for them, so it's not a, you know, it's not a small price to pay. It's very expensive. It comes with the base station. In the back of the base station this is where you would plug in the optical drive in or out and auxiliary and if you're actually feeling this headsets a little bit I'll even play this um Pretty fucking cool. So anyway, if you did like those, you can pick these up for yourself. They have special edition ones as well. But this is the one I got right here. It's the black and gray, which is compatible for PC, Mac, and PlayStation 5. If you choose the gold one, it's going to be uh, compatible for PC, Mac, and Xbox Series X or S. So that's pretty much it. For this video, I really hope that this little bit of information saved you so much time. It took me like three months to finally figure out how to get it all together. And honestly, you don't have to go through that because I put this video up. I'm sorry I didn't do it sooner. I didn't realize like how much of a demand for 
this issue there was in YouTube and especially Reddit. Like I was looking through and so many people having this issue. Hopefully this video helps. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe. I will be posting way more videos and tips. And if you did like the video, please like it. Leave a comment if you have any questions. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care.